Hey Kara, it's Thursday, and um, yeah. Um, as you know, if you guys have been following my tweets, and Kara, I know you have definitely. Uh, this has been an interesting week already. I yeah, had some issues yesterday that uh, were kind of troublesome. Um, yeah. So here's a clip of how that went last night. Just so you know, I'm sitting on my floor in case I faint. I hate that it won't come out on the first pull. I can do this. Oh, I hate taking out the earring for the first time. Oh, the worst part of this ever. I'm just gonna, oh, thank goodness. It's you, Kara. You say good luck. Yeah, not so well. Um, I did eventually get everything worked out, and my ears are just kind of sensitive today. Actually, you know, I, I waited an extra month and a half to take my earrings out because they're very prone to um, just like infection and they're really sensitive and all that wonderful stuff. Um, so finally, finally yesterday, I'm like, okay, they're good enough. I'm just going to change them. But I hated it. So, yeah. Um, Today I want to just go through a little bit uh, non-spoiler review of what I thought of John Green's The Fault in Our Stars. Um, as you see, I did pre-order this book and got the signed copy. See the J squiggle. Um, what I found is that the books of John's that I do actually decide to buy, they are my least favorite of his. Um, I also bought Looking for Alaska and I really didn't like that one at all. Um, so that was a super purchase. Um, and then this one, it was just not my cup of tea. I mean, I should have known with just my experiences in life, I should have known better than to pick a book about children with cancer, you know, because that's, like, there's nowhere to go but down, right? And, like, the first half of it was really good, and just then, you know, stuff started, the books started getting deeper into their lives and going through everything, and... Um, as John has said a few times, this is a book that'll make you, you know, laugh and cry and, like, go through everything. Well, I don't like to cry. Like, I don't. So, I don't like movies that make me cry. I don't like books that make me cry. So as soon as this book started to make me cry, I am like, I am done with this book. Like, I am not reading it anymore. But of course, I'm like, I hate you, but I have to keep reading. So, I mean, it was really good all the way through, but it's more of a love-hate relationship that I have. Yeah. So, yeah, I mean, really good. Just, I should have known better than to buy, buy this one. Yeah. But I, I hope you did well on your exams this week, Kara. Good grades. I hope you got good grades on them. And uh, I will see you on Tuesday.